might be wondering about Nate. Yes, Tina's dad passed away, but it's been a whole summer and Tina seems to have accepted her dad's passing. Are you all set? Yep, don't forget your lunch. Thanks, Mom. Are you sure you're ready for school? Yeah, I'm good. See you later. After school, come straight home. Like I said, Tina seems to have come to terms with her dad's passing. I hope they won't bug me. Yes, Tina was worried that now the whole school would know about her and start feeling sorry for her because of her dad. Um, hey? Hey, uh, do you recognize me? Nah, should I? Mm -mm. <sighs> well, it looks like Tina was stressing for nothing. No one even knows her. <gasps> Tina! <laughs> How are you doing? Great, ready to reclaim my spot as the top student and get into Harvard. Uh oh, here we go again with the competition against Zach for the best grades. Don't even get me started on him. Just the name Zach gives me the creeps. Ugh. I hear you. So this year is gonna be as usual? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no way. We're in high school now. It's time to be popular. Say what? Seriously? Yep. First step, we snag ourselves some boyfriends. And I've got a plan, Gwen, that you'll start flirting with Adam. And I'll back Tyler for myself. And who's left for me? You'll be with the new kid. Word has it he's Don's cousin. Well, but they're still not part of the cool crowd. True, but they're not bad either. The popular ones are off limits for now. Then I'll start dating Chris. Hold on, little missy. Chris is the school crush, and he's way out of your Chris league. Chris is way out of your league. That's what I said. <sighs> not for long, but first we need some awesome outfits, so let's head home and change. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Final touch to go. Oh, that hairpin. Here you go, sweetheart. A little gift for you. It's so beautiful. Thanks, Dad. It will bring you luck. Thank you. Exactly what I need. Yeah, unlike you two, we agreed to dress up nicely, remember? Well, I wore a clean top. What do you mean? I've got the trendiest outfit. <sighs> you guys are clueless. <sighs> well, thanks for the game. <laughs> See ya. Bye. <laughs> All right, Gwen, go <sighs> chat with Adam quickly, and you make your moves on the new got guy. It! Hey, Tyler. I'm Tina. We're both in the same bio class. Hey, I remember you. Uh, listen, I was thinking, uh, how about we go grab a coffee or something? I'm always up for that. Tomorrow everything works for me. See you then. <laughs> yes, it worked! <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Trying to hit on Tyler? <laughs> so what? I'll have a boyfriend soon. Unlike you, who will never have a girlfriend. Oh, come on. Tyler will turn you down, and you'll stay unkissed forever. Who would kiss a frog like you? <laughs> Give it a rest. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oops, my bad. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> I won't go unkissed. What? Oh, no, no, no. I know that look. What are you planning, Tina? Well, see you later. Uh, hold on. Kiss me? Right now? Do you want to do it right now? Well, if you're asking, I can do it right now. Uh, no, let's do it after school. There are too many people around here. All right, then let's make it tomorrow. Goodbye. Well, well, I didn't expect that. Huh, it seems so simple. Or is it? <laughs> hey, Ariel. Oh, what are you guys doing? Huh? Hey there! Not so loud. 
completely agree that Tina should be the first to find a boyfriend. You know how tough it can be for her even though she doesn't show it. I know, but Dan and I are in love. In just one day? Well, actually, we've been dating since the beginning of summer as soon as I moved here. What? Yeah, I was worried Tina would be upset if I found a boyfriend before her. Uh, fine, I promise I won't tell her. <laughs> But he needs to get going. Tina will be here any minute. All right. Goodbye, sweetheart. So, how's the boyfriend sitch going? Not great. Same here. Adam is getting on my nerves. He's so pushy. Hmm. Well, everything's going great for me. <gasps> Tyler, Tyler became, became your, boyfriend? your boyfriend? Nope. It's even better. But it's a surprise for now. You'll see it soon. <gasps> ah, yes. Tina's therapist. Even though Tina seems to be coping with her father's loss, her mom sent her to a counselor. Hey! Hi, Tina. How are you? How was your first day at school? Mm, couldn't be better. Chris agreed to kiss me. We'll be a couple soon. <laughs> Um, Chris, are you sure? I've heard he's a player and kisses mean nothing to him. You just don't get teenagers. Tina, I'm really worried about you. Right now, it seems like you're trying to distract yourself from your grief with a crush. But your dad. Whoa, don't bring up my dad. I've come to terms with his absence. I just wanted you to be happy for me and you. <sighs> Hey, so are you ready? Uh, ready for what? <gasps> Is Tina talking to Chris? No way! Well, you wanted to kiss. I have the house to myself right now. We can go to my place. Awesome, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Wow, unbelievable! It looks like Tina will be the talk of the whole school now. Yep. Tina couldn't believe she was at her crush's place. This was beyond her wildest dreams. All right, let's make it quick while my parents are out. My mom doesn't like it when I bring girls home. Okay. Wait, G can I get some water? I'm really thirsty. Sure. Oh, Tina, focus. Oh. <laughs> Gum. These are minty. Hey, what's up? Are you all right? Have some water. Thanks. Oh, it's ah, just making it worse. Oops. <sighs> My favorite t-shirt! Uh, listen, I suddenly remembered I need to go home right away. Uh, goodbye! What? Tina, did you just back out? Come back! Uh, well, how about that? I'm back! Why did you take so long? You were supposed to be home right after school! Well, I had things to do. I'm a teenager. What? Are you talking back to your mother? Now go quickly and replant the flowers! What? That's dad's garden. Why do I have to do it? Go do it right now! Like I told you! <laughs> hey there! Oh, I see you're not going anywhere. Uh-huh. <gasps> Spill it! What happened with Chris? Uh, what happened? We went to his place to make out. <gasps> what? what? You, you kissed, kissed Chris? Chris? <laughs> uh, well. Come on, Tina. You're not gonna lie to your friends, are you? Yeah. <gasps> <gasps> All right, Tina. You little liar. Oh, oh my God! God. <laughs> are you two a couple now? Well, we haven't really talked about it, but he's totally into me. <laughs> <laughs> What's with all the cheering? Hello, girls, and goodbye, girls. Tina has a lot of work to do. All right. Goodbye, Mrs. Kitty. Bye, Tina. Don't get distracted. 
These flowers are driving me crazy. Ugh. These eyes. Just like my dad's. Tina, if a cat with your dad's eyes comes out of his garden, it doesn't mean your father has turned into a cat. Besides, he belongs to someone. He's on a leash. Dad! <gasps> Tina, shall we keep talking? About what? Well, like how you're really fixated on Chris. And you even misled your friends. I didn't mislead them. They themselves said I made out with Chris. I just didn't deny it. That's still misleading. Nah, even dad supported me. Dad? Well, not exactly him, but his soul in a cat. Don't give me that look. Yes, I believe in soul reincarnation. <sighs> Go on, tell me I'm crazy. No, not at all. If that's what you believe, maybe try having a chat with a cat next time. <sighs> Mom, I'm back from my therapy session. Oh, really? Uh, what are you doing with Dad's skateboard? I'm thinking of selling it. No way! Seriously? You, you can't sell it! <laughs> Dad loved that skateboard! Dad isn't here anymore! I'm the one in charge and I'm selling the skateboard! <laughs> How could you? Do you want to erase every trace of Dad so nothing reminds you of him? You never loved him, did you? Shut your mouth and go to your room! <laughs> <sighs> Come on, sweetheart, you can do it! This is a silly idea! Skateboards are for teenagers! Skateboarding is all about freedom! Ah! Ah! Oh, don't worry! I've got your back! I'll never be able to ride it! Uh, you just did! You rolled a whole meter and a half by yourself! Imagine how much fun we'll have riding together in the park, and it'll chase away those blues! You really think so? Absolutely! But I won't sell it. The best part when, when Ron, Ron leaned, leaned to kiss her. her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, why is Chris chatting with Casey? He's your boyfriend, um, right? We just decided to keep our thing low key. <laughs> Aren't you even a bit jealous? Lay off. Casey's just his friend. All right. Next class. You'll have to split into groups for a project. How to solve world hunger. Cool! Can I go solo? These guys will just mess it up. What did you say? So what, you're in charge? You're the one nah, who started I'm not gonna it. Roll we would do an that awesome way. job uh -huh. on this project! Quiet! Zach! Tina! We said you wouldn't bicker over who's better! He's the one who started it. I want to do the project solo too. Nope! You'll work in groups of three! Awesome! Tina, join Cassie's group! <gasps> Tina, you're always with us. Why are you so quiet? Are you in? A pivotal moment. Will Tina pick her friends or a chance to hang out with her crush? Uh, yeah, sure. I'm with you. Of course. She thought Chris had the hots for her and went with him. Great! So the second group will be Zach, Ariel, and Gwen. Hmm. Hmm. Can we start working on the project now? I'm already on it, brainstorming ideas. What? Don't you want to hear our ideas? About what? You guys are dimwits. Your grades are only decent because of your oddball friend, Tina. <sighs> Would an oddball girl make out with a hottie like Chris? What? Tina kissed Chris? Yup. She's cool and you're a goofball. Work on your project solo then. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, folks, any ideas on how to tackle world hunger? Just feed everyone! <laughs> <laughs> That's a decent idea, but we need a plan to actually get that food. Jeez, Tina, you're such a downer. Why'd you even bring her along? Tina's smart, and with her, we're bound to get a top grade. Hmm. Ah, Chris invited Tina just for the grade. <sighs> Poor Tina. She thought he had feelings for her. <sighs> Jotted down a few options for readily available food. Great! I'm confident you'll make everything work out perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Tina can finish everything up at home and we can finally head to the party, huh? Yeah, if you're up for it, you can join us. Mm, all right, I'll wrap things up at home later tonight. For now, let's have a blast! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> you're the best! <laughs> <laughs> a party? Interesting. 
How will Mrs. Kitty react to this? <laughs> Woo! 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 Oh. Hey, Mom. The project's kind of complicated. I might stay out a bit later. What music? Woo! Don't make things up. <laughs> All right, catch you later. Hooray! Yeah! Yeah! Hey, Tina. Grab a milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Chris? Same old, hitting on some girl. I know, it's cool, right? Mm, got it. I think I'll head home. Already? We could hang out some more. It's so fun here. <laughs> oh, thanks. My mom's gonna give me an earful. Yeah! Yeah! Dad! Hmm. What? Dad, you came to cheer me on. She's talking to the cat? Uh, you know how much I need these chats. Mom's always yelling at me. Daddy. No, Tina, don't touch him. What if he's contagious, ah! Tina? Ah! <gasps> Stupid cat. Huh, all set. Wow, you're like a cat whisperer. Totally, the cat whisperer. 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 Tina! Someone's in trouble. So, this is your project, huh? And what happened to your hand? I just got scratched by a cat. Nothing serious. Not serious? You lied to your mom. You are grounded until graduation. Scratch that until your children graduate. Hmm. <laughs> Can you stop making out now? Tina's about to show up. Well, she's not here yet. Oh, you two are already a thing? Yep, it's been a while. Uh, a while? Dan means we've known each other forever, practically. All right, go on, head to your class. We need some girl talk. See you later, my love. <sighs> <laughs> Why didn't you tell me? Well, you were busy yesterday. Got it. Gwen, how's it going with Adam? Hey! We're going to feed the ducks today. Not really feeling it. Uh, how about searching for mole burrows? No, Adam, I don't want to go anywhere with you right now. Uh, and fight someone else. Fine. Uh, let's go feed the ducks? What buzz off? Uh. What about you? How's it going with Chris? Hey, Tina. The cat whisperer, yeehaw! You, you became, became friends, friends with, with Casey? Yeah, I'm kind of in the cool crowd now. Catch you in class. Wow, Tina's becoming popular. Just like she wanted. Mm -hmm. Good to see you. By the way, how's your hand? Oh, it's all good. Not even a scratch left. Great. Um, looks like this is yours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. We have physics later. <laughs> Uh, see you after class. Hey, here you are, nerd. <laughs> You're just jealous. I'm actually getting popular. Kissing Chris once will not make you a beauty. Please don't be jealous. <laughs> what? Tina kissed Chris? We gotta spill it to everyone. Yee I'm officially part of Chris's crew now. <laughs> just like you said, Dad. You are the most beautiful and amazing girl. And soon everyone will see that. What's this? It's a message from Chris! What's going on? What's happening? What's the deal? What's up? I want to see too! Why did you tell everyone that we kissed? Oh my! Darn it! How did he find out about my little scheme? Oh. <laughs> shush, 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 it's okay! Where's Tina? <laughs> Well done! Where are you going? No time. I have an issue with Chris. Ariel's got issues too. <laughs> I have a spat with Dan. <laughs> so what? You guys have only been together for three days. Actually, since the beginning of the summer. What? I didn't want to tell you. So you wouldn't get upset. You were already down because of dad. Oh, I get it. I couldn't care less about you guys. Got it? How can you say that? Easily. I've got bigger problems. The whole school found out that I kissed Chris. And what of it? Aren't you two a couple? No. I made the whole thing up. I ran away from the kiss. So 
you lied to us? Don't you want to apologize? No, I need to see Chris right away. <gasps> Unbelievable! She doesn't care about us! She's heartless! <laughs> That's it! I don't want to talk to her anymore! <laughs> <laughs> I know! It's so funny. <laughs> hey, Chris won't even talk to me anymore. What should I do? Do whatever you want. What do you mean? We're friends. We decided not to be friends with you right now. It seems like your problems are the only ones that matter. You're being toxic! Mm -hmm. I don't care. Get lost! Have you gone nuts? You get lost! Chris, hey! Well, Tina, it looks like this is the end. And what's this? What <sighs> is this? Could it be that Zach actually cares about Tina? How interesting. By the way, guys, it's my birthday today. Wanna come to my party? Absolutely! Uh, Tina, what about you? I'm on house arrest. Forget it. Zach is disappointed that Tina won't be there? That's unexpected. Uh, anyway, let's see what happens next. Be more careful with the knife! What's with these massive chunks? Dad liked it that way. Well, I don't! You'll do it the way I told you, or I'll extend your house arrest for another week! Ugh, her and her rules are getting on my nerves! Zach's throwing a party at his place and I'm stuck at home! Or am I? I hope hey. Tina doesn't show up. Oh, don't hold your breath. Hey! <laughs> I see. Hey, you actually made it! Yep. Happy birthday! Oh, whoa! A gift? You're the only one who got me a gift today. Uh, <sighs> thanks. Just remember, we're still rivals, and I'm better than you at school. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Anyway, have fun! Uh, hey! What do you want? I wanted to say thank you for not spilling about us not really kissing. I couldn't care less. Say whatever you want. Just don't come near me. Fine, got it. I'll leave. <gasps> Are you for real? It was an accident. You're the one who was waving your arms around during the dance. Gwen, maybe we should just go. No, I'm going to lay it all out for her. You know what? Yes, we tried to be more understanding because of your dad, but you've gotten too full of yourself. What do you mean? It's all about you, isn't it? You want to be the school queen? Well, the world doesn't revolve around you! You're just jealous because I've become cool and all of you have turned into an outcast! <gasps> <laughs> oh, wow! Here, to keep you from freezing. Let's go, I'll walk you home. OMG! Why did you help me? You said you didn't want to talk to me. Well, I felt sorry for you. The fight with your friends, wet dress, you know. I get it. Thank you. Wait! Uh, helping you wasn't just about pity. Um, you're actually cool. And I don't want to see you upset. Thanks. <laughs> uh, good night. <laughs> oh, yeah. Chris kissed Tina. Even if it was on the cheek, but still, <laughs> Tina's clearly very happy right now. Uh, good night. What's happening here? You sneak out of house arrest to hang out with an outcast? What? I'm not an outcast. Zip it! And you're even wearing his clothes! Take your stuff and get out! Sure thing! Mom, what are you doing? He's a good guy. You're not allowed to talk to boys until college. Get inside quickly. Uh, just when things were starting to improve, <laughs> Tina gets an earful from her mom. <laughs> You're the worst kid in the world, Tina! <laughs> <laughs> Kitty, calm down. It's not Tina's fault. She's a terrible kid. How could she lose the quiz side? It's not a big deal. We still have time before it starts. No! It's a big deal! I'm already fed up with her! You raise it yourself! I'm done! Kitty, don't lose your temper! Don't touch me! <laughs> if something like this happens again... Enough! I already know that you can't stand me! I don't hate you! Oh, don't lie! I heard what you told Dad on his last day! You disown me! I was just upset! Don't try to explain it away! It would have been better if you passed and dad lived! <laughs> oh boy, last night was something else. 
Tina had a huge argument with her mom and decided to run away from home. But where could she go? To her friends? After the fight they had yesterday, that's a no-go. To Chris? Definitely not. After what Mrs. Kitty said, he won't be keen on talking to Tina again. Oh, Zach! He has a big house. Hey! Can I crash at your place? Uh, hey? What do you mean crash? Aren't we enemies? Uh, you could have said no. Hold on! Uh, is something wrong? Yeah, I had a blowout with my mom and I can't stand living with her. Uh, well, all right, I've got plenty of spare rooms. I don't mind, you can stay. Hey there, I'm Kitty, Tina's mom. Oh, nice to meet you. Did you decide to join the therapy course too? That's great. No, therapy is just nonsense. It doesn't really help anyone. I'm here to find out what my daughter's been telling you. Well, that's actually confidential. Yesterday, she told me I should have been the one to kick the bucket instead of her dad. That's why I want to know what's going on in her head. I see. Well, why do you think she said that? Well, I guess I'm a bit too tough on her. Well, please tell me. Why do you take such a strict approach with her? Because there's no other way with her. Nate used to handle her, but I can't. He always had a way out of every situation. Are you worried that you won't be able to handle it? <laughs> yeah. I'm really scared. It's so tough without me. Tina is struggling too, <laughs> even though she won't admit it. You both need to go through this together. It will bring you closer. You think so? She won't listen to me. Give it a shot. And most importantly, no arguments. <laughs> Come on, kitty. You've got this. Uh, Tina, someone's here for you. Hey there, sweetie. Uh, I'll give you some space. <clears throat> How's it going, Tina? It's great. Zach's got this huge house, awesome food, and no one's bugging me here. Maybe you'd consider coming back home. I'll really try not to be so tough. I promise. Nah, I'm good here. Is that all you wanted? <clears throat> I also wanted to ask if you'd join me in scattering Dad's ashes. What? You want to completely get rid of him? No way! I loved and still love Nate. It's just been four months, and it's about time we do this. Just because you left his skateboard doesn't mean much. Do what you want. I'm not getting dragged into it. <laughs> I'm heading to the pier at four today for the ash scattering. If you feel like it, come along. Tina, you seriously won't go? Were you eavesdropping? Yeah, go with your mom. It's really important. Stay out of this. Why'd you call us together? <sighs> Tina's in trouble. Oh, I'm out. Hold on, it, it might be something important. <sighs> she always has these super important problems. We just made up. Do you want to start a fight again? No. Oh, but Tina's in a jam. She ran away from home and has been crashing at my place, and it turns out she's supposed to scatter her dad's ashes. What? what? What do you mean at your place? What's going on? Did, did she have a falling out with her mom? Yeah, Mrs. Kitty tried to patch things up. She's heading to the pier today at four to scatter the ashes and Tina doesn't want to go. Jeez, she's gonna regret this for life. Uh, holy cow, it's already half past three. We've got to see Tina right now. And what about me? Well, fine, I'll just chill here. Huh. Hey, why'd you bring them here? So you don't make the biggest mistake of your life. Tina, you need to go see your mom right now. No, I'm not going anywhere. She wants to get rid of dad. I don't want to see that. Maybe you're just scared of letting go of dad. I'm not scared of anything. Okay, yes, I'm scared. I'm gonna miss him. <sighs> <laughs> Something that needs to be done. No, I'm not ready. No, Tina, you are ready. Your dad will always be with you, right here. Oh, fine, you guys are always right. <laughs> then we need to hurry. Oh no, it's already 4.15, we won't make it. I'll drive you, let's go. <sighs> well, it's time to say goodbye. Mom, wait! Don't do it without me. 
Sweetie! <laughs> I'm ready to let go of Dad. Then it's time. <laughs> Let's head home. I parked the car a bit further away. Okay, I'll just be a second. All right, I'll wait. You're back already? Everything okay? Uh, yeah, everything's fine. Why didn't you leave? I was worried. I wanted to make sure you were okay. Wow. It seems Zack is no longer an enemy to Tina. She even seems to like him now. Whoa, 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 whoa! Well, she actually really likes him! What did you want? What's up with you guys? We decided not to be friends with you. You're ducks. <laughs> <laughs> and now, the final question in our quiz! Yes! Yes! <laughs> yes! Got it! <laughs> Uh, don't worry, I've got you covered. Maybe I kissed Chris too. Where's Chris? <laughs> As always, hunting for another girl. Mom, everything will be fine, hold on! What's wrong with Mom? Is she unconscious? Do you see what you've done with your antics? Mom, I'm sorry! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! That's amazing! Go, 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 go! <laughs> done! I did the task! Wow, Nate, you're amazing! <laughs> I'm next. Eva, truth or dare? Dare. Then kiss Dylan for five minutes. Uh, Eva, wait! I don't know, this is passion. Um. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I heard you were having a party. Hello, Cindy. Why did you come here? We didn't ask homeless people to the party. I just wanted to play games with you. Come on, girls. Let her sit with us. Yay! Thank you. Let me play along too. Truth or dare? Dare. <laughs> Go, Go home. home. <laughs> Goodness, why don't you like me? Because you don't have any money. You couldn't even chip in for the party. Get out of here. But girls, please. I want to join you. No one wants to be friends with poor girls. <laughs> Dylan, I'm ready to kiss. Ah! <gasps> Wait. Sweetheart, bon appetit. Alright. Thanks, Mom. It's better than Pepper. <laughs> I'm fed up! I hate everyone on Earth! Cindy, <laughs> why are you so angry? Are you hungry? <laughs> no, I don't have any money! Who has money? Don't get upset. Sit and eat. What is this? Where's the normal food? Sweetheart, that's all we had money for. How long can we go on eating slop? When will our family have money? Stop yelling at your mom! She tries really hard for us! This isn't trying! Our mom is just mean to us! Let her eat it! Why does she treat us like this? Mom, you know how Cindy is. <laughs> Why did you come here? Stop! Treating mom like that. I don't care. She doesn't have any money, and that's why I don't have any friends. Or maybe because you're stupid. Go away. Oh, grandma's chest with her jewelry. You know you're not allowed to take anything from it. We want to sell that jewelry and buy a house. And it's to remember grandma by. 
Oh, fine, I won't. Everyone already forgot about Grandma. <laughs> You're horrible and ungrateful. And I want to have money. <laughs> wow, I need to sell this. Although, gosh, this does remind us of Grandma. You're poor and ugly. We'll never be friends with you. No one wants you. No, I'm done. I don't want to live like this. Sorry, Grandma. Where is he? Hello? Where are you? I'm here. I'm here. Where? I don't understand. I'm next to you. Turn around. Well, there is some weirdo in a hat next to me. That's me. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't notice. Give me what you brought. I'll get it now. Oh, that's not it. Darn, it's not this either. Could you go faster? I don't have all day. Hold on. Tell me, how much for all of this? Well, it won't be a lot of money. Give me what you can. I just really need to sell it. Well, the total will be... What? Is this all for me? Ah! See you. Call me if you have more valuables. Hooray! I now have money! Woohoo! Cindy, what an unexpected meeting. Nate, do you want to go to the cafe? Whoa, so sudden. Or a shop or the movies? I'll treat. I can buy you whatever you want. <laughs> cool. Uh, you don't need to pay for me. I'll treat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh, I'm so tired. I still need to wash the floors. Maybe I'll earn a little money. Oh, hello. Please stay back. I'm cleaning the floors here. Ew, what are you, a cleaning lady? Yes, this is my first day. I decided to make a little money. Why do they allow beggars into the school? I'll finish my work and go. Goodbye. Is this a hole? Ew, gross. <laughs> she looks better like this. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop it. Ah! Get out of here. Qu quick. Or I'll hit your head with this broom. Oh no, you scared me. You should sit on it and fly away, you ugly witch. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, the students at your school are awful. Forget it. These are Cindy's classmates. I hope my daughter isn't friends with them. Mom, let me help you clean the floor, and you can go sweep up somewhere else. Uh, darn, I'm out of lipstick. Try using your finger. Oh, very funny. Girls, I'm joining you. Why did you come? We didn't invite beggars. I actually brought you presents. Presents? It's all for you. Oh, whoa! Casey, look how much there is! Lipstick too? Amazing! Wait, where do you get it? I bought it. You're lying. You're poor. You never have money. My dad bought it for me. He's rich. He just doesn't live with us. Of course. I guess this lipstick is pretty cheap. Eva, look. This lipstick is from a luxury brand. I've never had one this expensive. Oh, give it. This lipstick suits me better. My lips are cooler. That's why this lipstick is mine. Gimme, gimme, let, let go! What a pretty color. Uh, show me. Oh, it's really cool. So girls, will you be friends with me now? Of course. We're friends. 
Uh, yeah. Do you have any more money? Yeah. We were always friends with you. You just didn't notice. Hey, give that back. Uh, do you have any more money? Uh, maybe. Then give it here. We'll save it for you. We're best friends now. Wow, great. Everything is working out. What an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> well, daughter, let's put more money in the piggy bank. Uh, too bad we can't take any back. We need to save so that we can get a good apartment. Well, yeah, we're hungry now, but we'll have a nice life later. Mom, I need… Ooh, the piggy bank. Don't touch! It's for the future! Mom, you wouldn't give me any money? Calm down. You didn't understand why we're saving up? I need to buy a new computer. I can't study without it. Oh, maybe we can think of something? What is there to think about? I'll take the piggy bank. Cindy, no! You're crazy! Go away! I need this money! Mom, what are you doing? Why aren't you saying anything? Maybe she's right. Cindy will study and make money. And then buy us a house. And now, shopping on her best friend's dime. <laughs> Hooray, Cindy! <laughs> You're the best! Girls, it's so cool that we're friends. We make a really cool group. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Cindy, are you buying us a dress? Should I? Of course. You make such wonderful presents. No one could do better than you. Really? Well, then take them, of course. Why even ask her? This idiot believes everything we say. <laughs> <laughs> Girls, can we pick out something for me? I want to be pretty too. Well, fine. But why? You're so stylish as is. Yeah, you have such cool clothes. Not like ours. <laughs> I thought I looked like a beggar and needed a makeover. Don't even think of that. We need to change our style to look more like you. All right, let's go try these on. Cool. They really are my friends now. And they think that I'm cool. <laughs> Mom, do we have to go out into the cold? Of course. We need to make some money. Uh, why doesn't Cindy make money? She just takes what we have. Stop it. You know that our Cindy is studying. Of course, there's no way the stock's going down. We'll make millions. Or billions. <gasps> I think that's our client. Get to work. Oh, I think you dropped something. Thank you so much. You're such a good young man. Someone else would have walked past and not even noticed. Let us polish your shoes to thank you. Um, all right, uh, polish. Whoa, uh. hmm? huh? Whoa. Uh, are you sure you know what you're doing? Well, yeah, we're professionals. And done. What is this? You ruined my shoes! That's impossible! Sorry, we didn't mean to. That is real leather! What did you polish my shoes with? Um, maybe we can fix it. Mm, no, thanks. Well, we didn't manage to rip him off. Oh, look! A phone! Maybe we should call Cindy and find out how she is? Hello, sister. Where are you? I'm in class. I'm doing my homework. That's it. I have to go. The teacher's here. Mmm, what a delicious cocktail. Everything's fine. Cindy's in class. Let me look at this phone. I've never seen one like it. Oops. I think it broke. Uh, do you know if I left my phone here? 
No way! What happened? I'm sorry! It suddenly slipped away! Uh, you ruined my shoes and my phone! Get out of here or I'll call my bodyguard! What's that? Do we still have money? Uh, of course. The important thing is, is that Cindy doesn't spend all the money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Cassie. Thank you for inviting me over. Your bath is so cool. With the bubbles. <laughs> it's a jacuzzi. Ah, cool. Cindy, who told you to take my robe? Uh, sorry, I just liked it so much. Uh, uh, let's go to the beauty salon. Girls, why are you spending money on salons? I'll do everything myself. Huh? No, don't. You can't do anything. There's nothing better than a professional salon. Uh, take the money. I'll go pay for the services. Oh, wait. Uh, don't take the money. Uh, let us do it. We changed our minds. You can do it all. Well, all right. I'll get set up. Huh. We can't let her take all her money. Okay, girls. Let's do the foot treatments. Mm. In a basin. Great. I heard about this, and now I'll do it to you. Ew, is this dirt? <gasps> worms! 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 Cindy, you'll pay for this! Oh no, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. <sighs> There's no time to rest. We need to work. Don't be shy! I have delicious candy! Eva, look! It's that cleaning lady! Now she's a clown! <laughs> <laughs> Hello! Buy delicious candies! You mean these? Hey! Why are you doing that? Go away! Hey, 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 the clown is angry. Go cry. My mom's in a clown costume. If she sees me, she'll embarrass me. Oh, I know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Take that, ugly clown. <laughs> hey, girls, come here. Wait, uh, we're embarrassing this clown. <laughs> Join us. <laughs> Cindy? Is that you? What? How do you know my name? Shut up, you stupid clown. <laughs> That's all. Let's get out of here. Let's go to the cafe. You made it. <laughs> Why is this happening to me? I can't. Humiliation every day. <laughs> I think I'm starving. Cindy, where are you going off to? We need your money. <laughs> you. But you girls bought presents for yourself. <gasps> what? Cindy. You. Girls, thanks for worrying about me. We were worried about the iPhones in the box. Phew, they're fine. Cindy, be careful. Hello. Are you ready to make an order? Oh, I don't know yet. Now we're ready. I want this, this, and this. I will this, 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 and this, and this, and this. Cindy, did you choose yet? Well, probably not. I'll have tea. Aren't you hungry? No. Actually, I'm on a diet. Ah, uh, great. I want two more desserts and a cocktail. Me too. Bring me that too. All right. Hold on. Uh, you sit here. 
Here's the money. I'm off. It's great that she went off and left the money. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Call the boys. Now my Cindy's clothes won't have holes anymore. Mom, give me money quick. Cindy, you again? Take your clothes. I sewed them. I don't want them. I want money. Ugh. But I don't have any more. But why do I have to listen to this? You're my mom. You should give me money. It's probably for school again. Yes, for school. I don't understand. Where is all grandma's jewelry? What? Her jewelry? I don't know. I wanted to sell it to give you money. But now, what do I do? I'm tired of this pauper's life. And I'm sick of you. <laughs> How awful. Where's all the jewelry? <laughs> Mom, what's wrong? Someone stole... Tina... They stole everything! <laughs> Mom, it's Cindy. She needed money, so she decided to steal it. My Cindy couldn't do that. Or maybe she really fell into bad company. No, Tina, think about what you say. Why do you always believe her? Mom, you can stop. It's definitely someone who broke into the house and stole all our valuables. Well, yeah, everyone would want to break into this beggarly house. <sighs> if I find out that it was Cindy, I'll... Mm. We need to take Cindy for what she's worth. Let her pay. Exactly. Hello, are you Casey? Yes, yes, that's me. Your equipment has arrived. Bring it in! Uh, let's go. Casey, what did you order? You'll see soon. Wow, you've got so many things. Well, now we have a friend with money. <laughs> That'll be $3,700. Great. Now an idiot will come by and she'll pay for everything. Then I'll wait outside. Hooray! We're training this Cindy and she isn't noticing! Girls! Oh, our wallet is here. I mean, our best friend. Uh, give me the money. We want to pay for the purchases that we ordered for you. Uh, there's no more money. How's that? I gave you my last money. This is everything that's left. Are you crazy? Give us money, idiot! Or we won't be friends with you! What do I do? Where will I get it? We don't care. For example, you could rob a rich person. After all, it's for our friendship. What? Steal? Well… Although… It's a good idea. I'll go rob someone. What? Are you serious? Yes. I'll do anything for you. <laughs> Did Eva really go rob someone? Well, are you going to pay? I guess not. Why are you screwing me over? Guys, let's take it back. Right. This is the house of a millionaire. There must be money here. Oh, a safe. Gosh, someone's coming. Uh. Oh. I love getting more money. Phew, <sighs> didn't get caught. <gasps> now I can give money to my friends and my mom. Although, never mind. 
Perfect! I have money! <laughs> yes, I said that it would reach a million dollars by the evening. Don't let him notice! Don't let him notice! Stop! <laughs> That's all! I'm done for! <laughs> Who are you? What are you doing in my house? Hello! Uh, I'm, well, uh, personal chef. Ah, right. I asked the agency for kitchen help. Phew, it worked. Go into the kitchen. I'll show you what to do. Uh, no, 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 no. I changed my mind. Sorry, I gotta go. How strange. Everyone, welcome to my party. <laughs> wow, it's so pretty here. Cindy, you found money? Yes, I rented a room and decorated it. All for you, my friends. Ew, uh, you still smell like trash. We're here! Hooray, boys, you're going to be at our party too. Well, yeah, Cindy invited us. We couldn't say no. Nate, let's dance! <laughs> Woohoo, boys, you're so cool. Everyone dance! The important thing is that we're friends. Everyone stop. This is a robbery. Huh? I mean, an arrest. Everyone lie down. Hands over your heads. Ah! ah! What's happening? There's a thief among you. Yeah, there you are. I never stole anything. There's video evidence. You'll answer for what you've done. No way! What an idiot! She couldn't even do that properly! Why did we get caught up with her? We need to help Cindy! Uh, no! Let her figure it out! Uh, Nate, dance better! <laughs> Cindy, talk quick! Why did you steal Mr. Zack's money? I didn't mean to! It just happened! Then give it back and I'll let go of you! There's no money! <laughs> daughter! What is it? Your daughter is a criminal! She stole money from a millionaire! How embarrassing! She's facing time! Five years in prison! It's my fault! I asked her to steal it! Don't touch her! I need money for medicine! For my heart! Enough! This means you'll go to jail! Mom! What are you doing? Put me in jail, but don't touch my daughter. Go into the cell and wait for your trial. No, Mom, not this. Cindy, this is all your fault. You're a walking disaster. What have I done? Mom, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't worry, darling. It's not your fault. I'm the one to blame. Mom, I can't live without you. Girls, you're grown up. You can manage without me. No, Mom! No! Mom, Tina, I'm sorry. I'm a horrible daughter and sister. I'll fix everything. Enough! You already did this, thief! I'll give back the money. I'll earn it all. Take care, girls. Stop standing there. Time's up. Leave the premises. No! I can't just leave, Mom! See what you've done? Cindy, you stole money. You did this to mom. You're not my sister anymore. Sorry, all. Do what you want. But you should help get mom out. Where is it? The clown costume. Why do you need mom's costume? You want to laugh? No, I'm going to work. I'll sell candy like mom. <laughs> I don't trust you anymore. I'm sorry. I'm so ashamed. Here. Here's the costume. I'm doing this for mom. I'll get her out. Just be careful. <sighs> Come and get the most delicious candies in the world. <laughs> oh, look who's our clown now. <laughs> Go away. Our former friend. No way. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even manage to steal the money, weakling. 
We were already packing our bags. We thought you would take us to Italy. <sighs> my mom's in jail now. I trusted you. I gave you all my money and you're laughing at me. <laughs> well, you're stupid for falling for it. Now I understand. No one's more important than my mom. Did you really think we would be your friends? Look at yourself. You're a beggar. And beggars only have cockroaches for friends. <laughs> Smelly clown. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Leave her alone. Quick. Go away. Look, our champion has been found. <laughs> Nate, thank you. Uh, why are you in a clown costume? I need money. I got my mom into trouble, and she needs to be rescued. I'll help. I'll give you money. I don't have much. I've been saving for college, but I'll give it to you. Nate, why are you helping me? I really want you to be happy. Nate? I guess you're a real friend. Hmm, yeah, a friend. Where's mom? Where's Cindy? Mom, Cindy! <laughs> I'm home now. I told you, I'd save mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think I'm not well. Mom, what is it? I'll bring medicine now. Oh no, we don't have any. Good job. You got mom? Could you pour some water? Right away. My heart hurts. It's probably nerves. Mom, are you upset with me? No. What do you mean? You did everything right, sweetheart. Mom, I have one more thing to return. I'll be back. Hold on. Ah, uh, have you decided to confess that you stole grandma's jewelry? <laughs> what? Is it true? No one broke into the house? <gasps> Mom! Mom! Wake up! Not this! Mom! Wait! I'll call the ambulance! Mom! I'll earn money. I'll give money to Mom. Hello. Nate, whoa! What are you doing here? Uh, I came to see you. Wow! Is today a holiday? Why these beautiful flowers? I just wanted to cheer you up. Nate, you're helping me and supporting me so much. I always dreamed of a friend like this. I'm sorry. I'm not your friend. What? You want to draw me like Cassie and Eva? Enough. Go away. I'm going to wash the floors. Uh, uh, I, uh, I, uh, look, uh, I'm not your friend. I want to confess. Confess what? I love you. Cindy, I really like you. Wait, how is that possible? I couldn't confess it for a long time, but when you hugged me, I had to tell you. Well, today sure is a day. Listen, uh, let me help you wash the floors and then we'll go on a date. Wait, you'll get all dirty. So I can change. Wait, don't. Uh, you can help like that. Cindy, where are you going? Uh, Mom, everything will be fine. Hold on. What's wrong with Mom? Is she unconscious? Do you see what you've done with your antics? Mom, I'm sorry. <laughs> if something uh, happens to Mom, I'll never forgive you. Cindy, Tina, I love you. Mom! <laughs> Mom, forgive me for everything. I'll find money and you'll get better. I found a job. I'm all right. But Cindy, never do things like this for money ever again. <laughs> all right. I won't let you down. As long as you're okay. Mom... Well, 
yeah. <laughs> After the sentence, I'll hold on a bit if I couldn't get it. All right, take two. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, wait, we're not supposed to be in the frame. No. Don't be silly. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh scary. DJ Cindy is spinning records from the Candy Sausage Disc Superset. Hey, bring it back right now! Why did you eat the whole portion of porridge? I only allowed you half of it! I'm really very sorry, Mrs. Christie. Don't touch her! It's not her fault! Ah! Rotten children! No one will ever adopt you! <laughs> Today I, famous politician Chris, visited an orphanage. <laughs> Anita, take a photo. Take the candies. <laughs> Hello? What? <laughs> Impossible. I'm adopting these girls. What? In this house. <laughs> wow, what a chimney. Get out of there. <laughs> You're so boring. <laughs> Dad, do you like my new toy? Look. Stop screaming. Or what? <laughs> Or I'll lock you in a small, dark closet! Oh, please. That doesn't scare us. We were locked in a closet like that every day in the orphanage. I don't like arrogant people. Mm. I'm so sick of this. I'll show you. I thought we'd finally found a kind, loving dad. He's just as nasty as the headmistress. Girls, don't worry. Everything will be fine. Delicious. Cindy, don't shove so much food in your mouth. Mmm, tasty. Girls, where are your manners? Manners? You need to hold the fork like this. Uh. Like this? Wow. <gasps> Look. A UFO! Hello! Welcome to Earth! Are you Ooh. stupid? Sit down! Well-brought-up girls don't stand on the table. How do we do this? This is the right way. Like this. <gasps> mm. Wow! Don't hurry. Everything will work out. Nate, you're so kind. I wish our dad was like that. <sighs> Do not worry. He will see your manners and get nicer. <gasps> oh, should we share burgers with dad? Great idea! <laughs> <laughs> I hope he'll be really happy. <laughs> You have such amazing daughters, Mr. Chris. They're my pride. Cindy sings wonderfully. Ah!
Actually, I sing. Mm, yes, Cindy. I'm talking about you. Oh, how lovely. <gasps> sing for us, darling. Come on, come on. <clears throat> and oh, I... This is boring. By the way, I am a cheerleader. My dad! Woohoo! Hello! Well, I can dance on my head. <laughs> ah. Oops. You're so talented. I'm sorry. I just love to dance so much. They're golden. Mr. Chris, you're such a good person. You saved these adorable orphans. Uh, uh, thank you for the interview, Anita. This is for you, Mr. Chris. <laughs> well, da -a -a Are we cool? No. You have horrible manners. You just embarrass me! <laughs> He's being mean again! <laughs> Don't cry, Cindy. He's just in a bad mood. <laughs> Mr. Chris, the girls left you a treat. Mm. Let uh. them eat that garbage. Mm, of course it's not oysters. But it's better. Now be quiet! Mr. Chris, you don't think you're spending too little time with your daughters? I didn't hire a psychologist. You're a butler. Mm. You should do your work. <laughs> I said quiet! Maybe you should be a little nicer to them. They've bored me so much. Now I'll show them. I lost my appetite. Poor girls. <laughs> We're so poor and unhappy. <laughs> Why did he lock us up? Hey, stop it. We're finally rich. <laughs> Yeah, and our dad's a psycho! Did you see his face? Mm. <laughs> well, so what? At least he hasn't put us in a box, like Miss Christie. And he cooks well. Ugh, stop being stupid! Do you want to sit and wait until he releases us? These cages are all the same. I like it in the box. What? I couldn't see the headmistress's ugly face. <laughs> I think we need to teach our dad a lesson. Yeah, let's lock him in a box. Idiot, he won't fit in one. We should, uh, ruin his trousers. Go, Cindy, you're the smallest. You should do it. Just make sure no one catches you. Hooray! Lucky, we have an important job. We're spies now. <laughs> Go faster! Chris, thank you for agreeing to give an interview to our channel. Thank you, thank you. You're a wonderful audience. Thank you for your yeah. likes and comments. Tell me, how has your life changed after you adopted the three wonderful orphans? I'm very glad to be a father. There's such a wonderful element in my life. Oh. How strange! He hates us! <gasps> Why isn't he ashamed to talk like that? Don't <gasps> worry, girls. Now he'll pay. It'll be very interesting. Unbelievable. You're not just a talented politician. You're also a wonderful father. Thank you for your support, dear viewers. <laughs> Mr. Chris, sit down. No, no, no. I just wanted to drink in the applause. Boo! Boo. Uh, did I say something wrong? Get 
out of here right now. I said this is total cringe. He was embarrassed in front of everyone. Hooray! Our dad's a loser! <laughs> Good job, Cindy. You thought of cutting his belt. <laughs> <laughs> well, girls, I'm afraid he'll never love us after this. <gasps> Don't worry. Now he'll know that he can't treat us like this. <gasps> no, I don't want to act like this anymore. I'm sorry for him. <laughs> Are you joking? He's as evil as a wolf. That's it. I don't want to listen to you. I'm not playing these games anymore. Bad, bad, Cindy. <laughs> so you're on dad's side? Get lost. <gasps> Are you crazy? Eva, let's bet that he's good. What? Are you sick? Fine. Let's bet. If he doesn't change in the next few days, we'll go back to the orphanage. Deal. And you will answer to my lucky. <laughs> oh, these rich people. Uh, Mr. Chris, is everything all right? Who did this? Those horrible children! Mr. Chris, I don't think the girls could have done that. Stop defending them! And stop laughing! I'm sick of those girls! Mr. Chris, calm down. I'll calm down when these kids stop playing tricks on me! <laughs> Mr. Chris, your new look suits you. I'll throw them out of here if they bother me. Oh... Oh no, is Mr. Chris all right? Everything's fine, Nate. I'm okay. Oh no, we drove him off! Calm down, we're not here for that. On the other side, he wanted to drive us out. Eva, this time we went too far. I don't want to go back to the orphanage. I need to support him. Let's go quick. We need to understand where he is. Cindy, what happened? My lucky. He's sick. Now, we will heal him. Hooray! Lucky, be strong. It'll hurt a little. You shouldn't make fun of Mr. Chris. He's not so bad. I don't want to anymore. It's all them. You see what happened to Lucky when he was thrown to the floor? Mm-hmm. Take him. He's healthy now. I hope Mr. Chris will also stop bullying you and you'll make friends. Hooray! Lucky's healthy now. Thank you. You're the best. I wish you were my dad. <sighs> Daddy, Dad, is everything okay? Leave me alone. Hey, we came to apologize. We're sorry. We won't act like that anymore. We're horrible children. <laughs> I'm tired of having you in my house. I'd rather kick you out. But we didn't do anything wrong. What's wrong, Dad? Can't you take a joke? I know who embarrassed me at the interview. It was just pants. We ruined some ordinary pants. How can you be so indifferent? Stop it! You ruined my reputation! Get out of here! Our conversation is over. You're mean and cruel. Let's go, Kenny. Let him sit here alone. Well, now I'll show him. What are you doing? I want to teach him a lesson. <laughs> Duct tape? Are you sure he won't send us back to the orphanage? I don't want to be poor again. Kitty, he doesn't care about us. Who cares about wealth? That's right. I'll help you, sister. Girls, do you want to hurt daddy? You're in time to help us. I don't want to. Or we'll return you to the orphanage right now. 
No, I don't want to go to the orphanage. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Serves him right. <laughs> I'm sorry for him. Quiet. Someone's coming. Let's go. I'm tired of these snot-nosed brats. Why did I take them in? <laughs> ah! Someone help me. Mr. Chris, I'll help you. Wait up. Quick, I'm stuck. Oh, no. Don't move. Stay still. There you go, you're free. Hey, Mr. Chris, are you all right? Mr. Chris! Uh, uh. Oh no, doctor, doctor, quick! Hey, uh, I want to too! Uh, how did you do that? I don't know. I guess I'm better at being rich than you. <laughs> what the heck have you done here? Oh no! What happened? What's wrong with you? Everything's fine with us. Why are you stuck? Oh no! He's stuck in the scotch tape instead of dad! Our dad got lucky again. So you thought you'd play a trick on him again? Yeah, but we didn't want you to suffer. Aren't you ashamed? He's sick! Well, we thought he'd laugh. Mm -hmm. We wanted him to finally have fun. Do not ever do that again. Now he's sick. <gasps> Will he be okay? I hope so. This is your fault. <laughs> Stop getting upset. <laughs> That's it. Stop crying. <laughs> We love you, Nate. You're not as mean as our dad. We'll never do it again. And now go apologize to him. Uh -huh. Okay. <coughs> How do you feel? We brought you some fruit. Oh, I feel horrible. Are you here to laugh at me? You're starting again. We want to support you. And tell you that we love you. <laughs> Lucky we love dad. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> You're just making things worse with your whining. What do you want from me? I'm sorry for making jokes. We just really want you to stop being mean. And for you to love us. And for us to have cool parties! Lucky and Dad and us will have the coolest parties on Earth! Hee! <laughs> Stop jumping! No, no, keep going! What? Hooray! Our dad is finally happy! <laughs> well, you're entertaining. I didn't notice that no one but you needs me. So you won't be mad at us anymore? Of course no. I acted like a total idiot. Please don't get mad at us anymore. Please. <laughs> I promise everything will be different now. Hooray! <laughs> Show me. What did you bring in? It's vitamins. You need to eat more. <laughs> mm. I've never eaten anything better. <laughs> we love you, Daddy. <laughs> and I love you. Ha! <laughs> 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 ah, caught you! <laughs> <laughs> now I'll eat all of you. <laughs> That's my dad! Don't touch him! <laughs> oh no! Don't touch us, dinosaurs! <laughs> dad, you're so cool! <laughs> 
and I love you too. And I know how to apologize for my bad behavior. Do you want to have a party? <gasps> yes! <laughs> I'll make a surprise. I need to prepare. Wait for me. I'll be there soon. <laughs> Hooray! A party! A party! <laughs> How cool! A party! Oh, prepare a cheerleading number! Just like this! Oh, look! Dad's on the floor! Ah! Where? Cindy, that's not Dad! It's his photograph! Probably they're writing about how cool he is! What? What is that? Show me, I don't understand. Chris's rival has kindly provided us with information. Chris adopted three orphans to raise his low ratings? What a nightmare! What? What's written there? I just read it. He adopted us for the hype. That's why he didn't love us? <laughs> so is that why he played dinosaurs with us? <laughs> Eva, let's go pack our things. We'll go back to the orphanage. Yeah, especially since his ratings are already up and he doesn't need us anymore. <sighs> There's so little money in the register. We need more sales. Don't worry, I'll buy everything. Ouch, I'm sorry. Mr. Chris is in our store. I'll help you. Is this all right? I need the very best for a party. Then take this. And this. I want to have a party for my favorite daughters. Thank you. I hope it's enough. Of course. Take everything with you. Thanks, take this and keep the change. Have a nice day. Hooray! Finally, I can quit and become a DJ like I've always dreamed. <gasps> How could he treat us like this? We're children. <laughs> Don't cry, he always acted like that. Yeah, we should have guessed that he was such a jerk. Dad always used us like a pile of garbage. Uh-huh. At least Miss Christie at the orphanage didn't hide that she was a jerk. <laughs> I want my mom. <laughs> we don't have a mom, idiot. Let's go, or we'll miss the bus. I tear another pair of his pants to say goodbye. Yeah, and be late for the sake of that stupid dad and go on foot? No way! <laughs> Girls, I don't want to go anywhere. Stop it, we're leaving. I want to stay with my dad, my daddy. He doesn't love us. But I still want to stay with him. This is for you, daddy, so you don't remember me. Take care of dad. I'll miss you. Cindy, <laughs> where are you? We'll be late. <laughs> Goodbye, Lucky. <laughs> Surprise! Oh, strange. Why is it so quiet in the house? Cindy, Eva, Kitty, are you here? Hmm. What is this? What? Who could have told the journalists that I adopted them for the ratings? She left her toy here. They couldn't have left. This must be nonsense. Nate! 
Where are the girls? Unfortunately, I don't know anything. They went off somewhere with their suitcases. What? I thought they were going on vacation. Are you totally stupid? You let them leave? And so, you didn't need them. None of your business. They're my daughters. I'm sick of you, Mr. Chris. Well, how are your ratings? Who betrayed me to my rival? Tell me. Well, what if it was me? Oh, you. Calm down. I'm just doing my job. I'm tired of pretending I like those poor children and tired of pretending that I like working with such a spoiled fat cat. Get out of my house. Good luck getting your ratings up, loser. I miss you so much, girls. I'll get you back. <laughs> I always said you were stupid, useless girls. Forgive us, Miss Christy. Now, get into the box, brat. <laughs> Why do you treat her like that? She did nothing wrong! Be quiet! Go clean the windows! Are you going to mess around more? No, I won't! Forgive me! Oh no! Don't touch my daughter! Eva, hold on! Stop, Christy! What are you doing here? They're your daughters! Actually, they're mine. I won't give them up. It's fine. Dad's here to save us. <laughs> now, go back. Or do you want to clean the windows again? How dare you hurt my daughters? And what are you going to do to me? I'll still get you all. Eva, do you have duct tape? Then let's go! Uh-huh! Cindy, Cindy, the, the chair! chair. Uh-huh! Ow! Take this, stupid old lady! Now she'll fly with us! Let's get out of here fast! She's going to be sick! Ew! Let's run! <laughs> Girls, forgive me. I really lied to you. Hooray! That means we'll still become rich! <laughs> <laughs> I understand you're angry, but I really love you. You were using us for your ratings. You didn't need us at all. I was a bad dad, and I'll never treat you like that again. Okay, and you forgive us for how we acted? And you promised us a party. And I prepared one. Go home. Hooray, yay! <laughs> we'll have a great time. Girls, this is all for you. This is all for us! Wow, no one has ever given us so many gifts. Thank you, Daddy, you're the best! <laughs> Cheerleading pom poms! Party! Party! <laughs> awesome! Now Lucky has a friend! <laughs> Dad, I prepared a song for you! Love you! No, look at the dance I learned! <laughs> hey, Cindy, I'm first! No, me! No, me! No, no, me. no, no, no! <laughs> Stop it! Let's party! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! Hands in the air! <laughs> Woo! You should party with 
us. Girls, I don't want to. This party is for you. But, Dad, don't be so boring. Fine. <laughs> Best daughters! <laughs> and I have the best job! <laughs> Who told this journalist that I'm a I'll throw them I know that you made me a I know that you're the ones who ruined my interview <laughs> Do you have duct tape with you? Was it? It's the most foundation.